Wait a minute. Yeah, like so. Anyway. Is usually defined as the act of hearing attentively. See what I'm talking about? See what I'm talking about? Ridiculousness. Hope you guys have a blessed day today. And she's back. I didn't say anything, meaningfully. You haven't said anything for the past minute. Nah, I just opened the blinds. I guess she like, ooh. Anyway. All right, y'all. Hope you have a blessed day. Uh, my mom's gonna say something made of fuss, I suppose. All right? Why you, why you look so good, y'all? I don't. God, yeah, that's me. <laughs> He's such a silly person, you know. I'm, I'm just we're just finishing up, packing up our bags, packing lunches up, usual stuff. Um, making sure everything is everything before we leave. You been cleaning that pot on the stove? It's clean. It's clean? I don't think so. I think you just took the pasta out and left it there. Come on. Yo, he's so annoying. Does anybody else's husband or boyfriend cut corners? Oh my when it comes God. to like household chores? Oh, he's still trying to put me on flat, bro. <laughs> yes, I have to sometimes. It's the only way it keeps you on, the to on your toes. All right, come on. <laughs> It is Thursday morning. We are headed to guess where? The train station. Um, to do what? To do what? Work. Work. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, what's going on this week? What's been going on this week? Nothing. Um, I think in the next clip I'm gonna just include my little lookbook for you guys. But I want before I get into that. Um, because I've been promising this video for mad long. And yeah, it's just time. Um, but yeah, y'all. Yeah, uh, just wanted to check in with y'all. It's Thursday. It's the last day in the office for me. I know Tony has to go into the office tomorrow. Um, you may not. <laughs> we'll see. Um, usually he ends up going to the office. No, he'll work from home for in the morning and then go in the afternoon. Nobody worried about him. Let's get into this capsule wardrobe, particularly for my curvy girls out there who have a little lump, a little bit of bump, <laughs> a little bit of something extra you're, extra you're working with, but you want to be professional, you want to be put together, you want to be that girl, you know? You want to be that girl that just struts in, everything's together, everything's up and running, everything is good, you're confident. Everything may not be perfect on your body. Nothing is perfect on my body. <laughs> but you're just here for, you're just showing up to your, your job or your career or you're you know, heading out the door to go send emails at Starbucks because you're an entrepreneur. And you just wanna be put together. You wanna look nice, you wanna look professional. You wanna look like you know what you're, what, what you're about to talk about. And I, love everything about i have fallen re-fallen back in love with fashion all over again i wanted to film this um it's not the way i wanted to film it but i just don't have time right now to do it the way i would want to do it and rather than put it off or never do it i'm just gonna do it here it is enjoy guys guys <laughs> so i'm here finally with the much anticipated uh like lookbook version of my wardrobe so in order to kind of create like a capsule wardrobe i always pick an outer layer two bottoms this is a black skirt and black pants and then three tops if you put this all together and make you can make a week's worth of outfits with just this three tops i have a polka dot um like a tunic type top i have a gray cami and i have a yellow like tunic type um top so i'm gonna put these on for you guys so you guys can see how i can make different outfit combinations with just these six pieces 
so outfit number one, please pair. Forgive the lighting, guys. I moved my mirror that I'm usually in the other guest room, the guest room in, uh, whenever I show you guys my outfits in the morning. But I wanted to move my mirror into my bedroom so you guys could see a little bit better. Um, I just paired the skirt with um, a black pump and uh, the black blazer and the polka dotted top. Um, and yeah, you can you can do tons of different things. I have some pink pumps and black flats here in the corner for this outfit for these outfits um but yeah i just love how this comes together it's easy just to throw together a quick work a quick work outfit that's both comfortable and cute you guys know i love a good high-waisted pant moment so i have these black pants um paired with the same polka dotted top the black blazer and i have my black flats that i'm going to throw on as well um, I'm also going to try these with the pink pumps. And then you have a really great work work outfit. Well, well I don't know why I was about to say workout. But yes, <laughs> great workout work outfit <laughs> that is a cute, comfortable, stylish, and fun. Um I'm a pair. Throw on these black. So you can always throw on another <laughs> shoe option for a pop of color i mean this is a lot of black and white um so you can always throw on a sh another shoe option for a pop of color you guys know i am a shoe addict i love shoes i think shoes bring so much to an outfit um so yeah here's an option as well so you just take that skirt Take that skirt that I have right here that I just had on, pair that with the other two tops to make additional outfits. So I think you can get three outfits from the skirt, three outfits from the pants with these two shirts as well, if you add this shirt in. Um, and then you add the outer layer, which is the blazer, the kimono, the cardigan, um, the duster. You can add different pieces together to create lots of different outfits. I'll show you guys another option with a little bit more color momentarily either of these pieces just yet to work but I wanted to show you guys how to pair a cute dress now I showed you guys in a, a previous work week in my life a sheath dress that was in black I also have um, another dress in a corally color that I love I love coral it's the end of the summer I gotta hurry up and wear this before the end of the summer but I probably will honestly end up wearing this into the fall and then I also have a tan blazer um, that I paired this with. I also have three other neutral pairs of shoes. I have kind of like um, a booty from Just Fab, some flats, some tan flats, and then I also have um, kind of like a leopard print pump. Um, I think just for the sake of this, I'm just gonna throw these on because I just love, I'm a Jersey girl at heart. So y'all already know, I love me a little leopard print. And I think this just adds um, a little bit of detail. I love the detailing on these shoes. And they kind of go with the detailing on the actual dress itself. Um, I just think it's really cute. Um, and these are super comfortable. I could wear these on the train to work um, easily without any problems. These are not uncomfortable shoes. Um, and yeah, they just add a little bit of a pizzazz um, to the actual outfit. Um, so this is just one idea. Um, if I wanted to jazz this up just a tad bit, let me put you here. I would take off the blazer. I wanted to be a little more comfortable. I don't know if you guys can even see me. Let's see. If I wanted to be a little more comfy, I would add maybe this kimono on top. Take off the pump and add in maybe this wedge. Just to kind of dress it down a little bit more. I don't know. Or I would just do the flat. So you can wear pieces so many different ways, guys. Um, don't be afraid to mix and match different options together to get the perfect outfit. So I just made two outfits out of this one dress, as you can see. So here's the kimono. Again, this kimono, and this dress is from New York and Company. Kimono's from um, 
Amazon flats are from DSW. But of course, I gotta adjust the dress, make sure the dress is long enough. But yeah, this is so cute. It's super comfortable. It works well. Very this this kimono definitely adds a summer vibe back in because you have the florals, even more spring. And the colors are just very bright. Um, but I just love how this looks and I think it's just super cute. So um, let me show you guys another option. Love a monochromatic kind of look. So pairing prints or same color tops with pants with a nude shoe or a shoe that matches like the whole outfit really streams streamlines your figure um i love dressing for my body as you guys know i've talked about this in several different videos um and yeah it's just been really fun to kind of just play around with prints um and pants i would also pair this with another kind of top like another a like pair the pants with like a colored top or something um, just to give this uh, another uh, look and feel. There's so many different ways you guys can dress. Um, my, my room is a mess now <laughs> that I've been filming this, but yeah. So this is kind of like this, both of these pieces are from New York and Company. Um, I just love this. This is a great transition into fall. I love the brown and neutral tones. And I think it just looks really, really, really good. I could pair this outfit with those nude um, booties that I have. I have, there are wedges. You could do anything to transition your looks. Um, this is how I build my capsule wardrobe. This is how I build outfits that will last me and I can interchange for months, months and months and months. Um, you just need one outer layer, two bottoms, three tops. You make six, six outfits out of that and it only gets and grows more and more the more you add to specific uh, pieces that you want. Um, I am looking for like a rusty orange colored pant that I can use and like move into the fall with. And I love, I love that color and I think it's gonna look so bomb going into the fall. So these are just little pieces I'm trying to add to my wardrobe so that as we transition from season to season, I can always have outfits that will move with me and I don't have to just buy new outfits and new pieces all the time. Like I'm able to kind of just switch out as long as I don't gain a ton of weight <laughs> in the next like year or two. I plan to like really just switch things out and yeah keep things going so I just love the way things look I love how I feel in my outfits I'm super confident when I walk through the office I feel appropriate I feel professional and I still look cute and look like my age I don't want outfits that are gonna age me or make me look too young either um, I don't want outfits that are gonna be inappropriate I want outfits that are definitely going to suit um, my you're supposed to dress for the career that you want or dress for the job that you want. That's, this is it. Um, so this is how I do that. And this is how I create my capsule wardrobe. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I hope it wasn't like too lengthy <laughs> or annoying. Um, but I definitely feel like this is how I build. You take basic pieces, put them together and build from there. So I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope this was helpful. I want to do more lookbook, actual lookbooks for you guys, but I wanted to make sure I got this video up so that you guys could see it and kind of visualize yourself putting together things from your own closet. Um, and that's it, yo. That's it's as simple as that. I hope that this helped and I hope this helps you guys to put things together for work or whatever occasion, whether it's church, work, a business meeting, um, just wanting to be a little bit more comfortable in your entrepreneurial journey um, and feeling good and put together. This is how I do it and a dress for my body. It just feels good. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.